So we shouldn't stop anyone from seeing this next roving reporter with a segment on surprise and delight marketing. Donna Bender is a certified Giveologist branded product specialist, corporate marketing trainer, creator of The Giving Plan, show host, published author, and GME roving reporter. Thanks, Kim and Carrie. This is Donna Bender coming to you today as a roving reporter for Good Morning Entrepreneurs. Today's surprise and delight marketing segment is on the first of a two-part series on to brand or not to brand. That is the question. I'm often asked if someone should put their logo on everything they give to their clients. So I like to share about many of my firsthand experiences working for both American and European designers in the fashion industry. That's where I learned the importance of knowing the difference of when to use branding on the outside, where everyone can see it, and when using branding on the inside added more value. For example, your company's asked to participate as a sponsor at an outdoor event, so putting your logo and brand on products is extremely important for your business and the perfect vehicle for your marketing dollars. Let's just take one product, promotional bags. The focus should be on your company because you're marketing your company. Do you know what the number 1940 represents? It's the number of impressions one promotional bag delivers over its lifetime. And check out some of these other stats from the ASI study in 2023 about why marketing your company on a branded bag works. 43% of users keep branded bags for an average of 18 to 24 months. And 26% of consumers are more likely to do business with advertisers that gave them a promotional bag. So in this case, to brand or not to brand, the answer is yes. Back to you, Kim and Carrie. Sorry, having a sound issue over here. There's an extra mute button. Thank you, Donna. Oh my goodness, that was that was awesome. <laughs> Donna's always high energy and I love it. But I love that she is sharing with us so that we know when to put our logo on products and when not to, and how important that step is in standing out from our competition. As Donna mentioned in her video, if you're providing bags in an event, she says that would be a good time to put your company's logo on it so people know you are there. And if nobody finds you at the event because you didn't have your logo on the product, you might wonder who's stopping you from telling everyone you are there. And speaking of telling everyone who is there, we can't wait to tell you about Donna's next show and tell, which is this coming Tuesday, February 27th at 1 p.m. Central Time, where she will show you how branded products and gifts can help you build relationships, retain clients, and make you stand out from the competition. Well, Donna's show and tell is going to be great. 